Welcome to Ask Joyce. Who's Joyce? This bitch. It's Ask Joyce. It's Ask. It's Ask. Ask Joyce. Today, I'm going to answer all your burning questions about the holidays. I recently went on my Instagram and asked all you cuties and booties exactly what kind of advice you need during the holidays. What makes me qualified? Who knows? But I'm cute. I live with terrible roommates, and I'm having a hard time feeling the holiday spirit. You know what you should do? You should blast Mariah Carey's. All I want for Christmas is you at six o'clock in the morning while you make eggnog and pancakes. And if your roommates got a problem with it, tell them that they can leave. Pay your deposit back and they can leave. So next, how can I get a holiday boo? And we're in winter. It's the time of commitment until the end of spring, which is when everyone breaks up after Valentine's Day. Go to a party, a Christmas party, like those ugly sweater parties, or like your church's like weird revival thing that they do every New Year's and snag a boo there. And if you don't have a holiday boo, that's still okay, because you have the greatest present of all, and that's you. Next, how to stay fit during the holidays. Don't. Next, my brother doesn't get me anything for Christmas each year. Should I buy him a gift or not? You know, the good person in me would say, of course buy him a gift. Everyone deserves a great gift on Christmas. Nah, don't buy him a gift because he ain't buying you nothing. And he's a disrespectful little crap head. And if he can't spend $5 at the Dollar Tree just to get you a little like trinket or a bottle of wine, Nah, next question. How do I survive my family? You talk to your family for a couple of minutes and then you go upstairs with a glass of wine and you play your video games. I hope you survive. What should I get for the guy that I really like? Something cute, something funny, and something cheap. Cause we don't waste money on boys. Next, how can I make Christmas more gay? I mean, you're gay. It's Christmas, done. How to live under the stress of the holidays without being miserable. You get rid of all the stress in your life. That means your hoes. That means your credit report. That means your enemies. Get rid of all of it and then just have a great time. Next, I can't rap. Me neither. Next, my family's very huge, but I don't want to waste all my money getting them gifts. You know what you do? Dollar Tree. Ah, the sweet, sweet smell of Dollar Tree. Everything is a dollar. You go in, you spend $40. That is 40 gifts for the 40 people that you love. And if they got an issue with it, tell them that they shouldn't have had so many kids so that you wouldn't have to spend more than $40 as Christmas gifts. Next. My BFF is my ex's sister. I'm gonna spend my holidays in their house with some of her friends. Yikes. I would be looking like a snack the whole entire time and then forget they exist. Because you know what, they're your ex for a reason and it's Christmas. You could be getting with somebody new. You could get a better gift with upgrades and an Apple ISO. WTF do I get my vegan health teacher for Christmas? If I know anything about vegans, they love their mushroom tea. And I love mushroom tea because it helps me poop a lot. Next, what should I wear to Christmas dinner? You should probably wear a nice pantsuit or nothing. What is a good snack for a holiday party? You. First holiday with divorced parents, what should I do? Well, I say if your parents got divorced, it's time to play sides. Get the best gifts out of both of them. Go to your mom and tell her great stories about how much you love her, and she'll probably get that Tamagotchi you always wanted. Then slip over to your dad's house. Tell him stories about how his steak is the best steak in the neighborhood. You'll definitely get that Maserati that you've always wanted. Next. So pretty much this person just sent me the words get kinky. Maybe you could do a Santa role play, or you know, you could be a dreidel and someone spins you like a top. How do I get a boyfriend before next Monday? Wow, sis, you, sound like you have the fake boyfriend scenario. I know you've been lying about him for months, telling your friend that he actually exists. Here's what you do. I want you to go on Tinder. Message each guy on your Tinder account, hey, I need a fake boyfriend. I know that your mom hates your real girlfriend, so why don't you go out with me? Once you find the guy, you send the pic to your family, friends, the guy that's creeping you out at your workplace. And who knows, if it's according to fan fiction, you might actually fall in love. Is it rude to return a gift? Totally. But I would just sell it on eBay like I do all the gifts I return. How to bear with loneliness during the holidays. Being alone, away from your family, away from your friends during the holidays for work, money, life, I get it, I understand. But one thing that you can always do is remember that you are loved and that they would rather be spending Christmas with you. 
So this has been Ask Joyce Holiday Edition. So if you have any other questions, please at me on Insta. I hope you have a happy holidays and I hope you're more drunk than your uncle is. I'm just gonna play you a little beat in the back. <laughs> Merry Christmas.